Thanks for watching this one. Peace. Enjoy this video. Really I'm really liking okay. this video package from filming. Yeah, it was a good package. It's still going on for me. Oh, there he is. God, he's yeah, changed his he's... look. He, he's got the mm -hmm. fresh lineup and everything, fresh beard. Yeah, I'm liking oh, his look so far. Now we got Oscar. Hey, Craven. Hey, David. Four man, Ronnie. Uh, give me a moment just to sort the chat out because obviously I have to change it for each yeah. individual stream. So give me a second. Yeah. But yeah, hockey doesn't start until this wrestling show is over. So we've full got making. Uh... Yeah, he looks different because he used to have a mullet. Now his hair is just bald. I like it. I like his new look. I didn't like the mullet look. I just felt it looked too 80s. And now he looks like his dad. Yeah, I like it. He looks like his dad, but even more insane. Looks like a younger version of his dad. Yeah. Oh yeah, he, his dad uh, died because of a heart attack, right? Goldberg is not going to be on AEW. Anyway. Why do you What's want an old, washed-up, dangerous person to be on a show anyway? Heavily into prescription drugs. Yeah. Heart condition. We're going to get it, Tom. Goldberg versus Sting. That yeah, and Sting can retire by being her. Yep. To be fair, that almost happened with Seth Rollins, remember? Seth Rollins almost ended uh, uh, Sting's career. It wasn't yeah. the other way around. No, no. Uh, your name is not Paul Heyman, it's Ronnie Hood. Yeah, your name is definitely not Paul Heyman. And you spelled Heyman wrong. Okay, so that one's done. Which means the only thing left is Edge. I like how they kind of tweaked his theme, though. Have you noticed, like, the, the You Think You Know Me part? That's a different voice from the WWE one. I have not. It's a woman's voice. Yeah, cool. Yeah, Jim Ross has like no filter, so his commentary was good. He used to go off on Kane and go off on Triple H. Um, get that cracking stuff off the screen. Uh, uh, no. Looks so much better without it. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Oh my god, not the Katie Vicky situation. Oh, yeah, fair enough, yeah, Evil. Yeah, Tom, stretch that NXT AEW and like cover the whole scoreboard. Just cover it up. Stretch it up. No. <laughs> mm. 
And here we go, main event time for NXT. What stats did I get? 200 views, 44 hours of watch time, not too bad for it. And now it's Christian coming out from the lead up. Wouldn't surprise me if it's Beth Phoenix. Would make a lot of sense if it was Beth Phoenix. I wouldn't be surprised. Does she still work for WWE or no? Uh, Legends contract, I believe. You're definitely going to see think... her backstage. Uh, oh, hey, Otis. Been... He's definitely been backstage at, at AEW, though. I'm going to go pee because I haven't peed the entire stream. Oh. Back myself. Yeah, same. Hey, Harry. Hi, thank you. God, people are strict nowadays. There you go. I'm in my dress code. Thank you. AEW's really taking full advantage of this. You can go over, aren't they? Oh, I appreciate it, Paul, man. I do like wearing my hockey jerseys during the hockey stream, so I appreciate If I'm not wearing it, let me know. I do plan to get another one at some point. I want, uh, I want, an, I want a Kraken away one, but I want to get the next size up because I like my hockey jerseys really baggy, and this one is it's a little bit baggy, but I want it baggier. That's why I love my Maple Leafs one because it's very baggy. Yes, Leafs. Yeah, it's cracking. Hey, Pirate Girl. I'm glad you're here. Yeah, we're not. Put, we're uh, at Vegas tonight, so uh, I'm very scared. Uh, yeah, the new Spider-Man game looks really good. A shame I don't have a PS5, so I'm going to have to wait for the PC release. Because I, uh, unless uh, they even officially announce a Ghost of Tsushima 2, I have no reason of buying a PS5. That. Yeah, David, I'm uh, glad you like the amount. Um, uh, but fun fact, uh, if someone gifts a load of subscribe, uh, a load of members, you may be allowed to pick the next emoji if you get over the emoji uh, number. Like, Borg got to pick Carlito. If uh, someone else gets me over the next number and they gift a load of subs, then they can potentially pick the next emoji as long as it's um, you like friendly for YouTube. <laughs> GTA 6. We're going to be dead before that comes out. KK's just thinking, please can this show end so I can get out of voice chat. Yep.
Yeah. Hopefully it does. I don't, to, I don't have to just wait for one shot. I have to wait for both. I think. I mean, at least we're on the main event for NXT. And AEW. Yeah. They already told us we'd hear from Christian Cage, and obviously, no doubt, we're going to hear him before his before Luchasaurus's match. Yeah. Yeah. If anyone was curious, uh, when the uh, new Silent Hill Two game releases, I will be doing that gameplay live. Mm -hmm. That will be a live playthrough. As soon as it drops, we're doing it live. Here comes Edge! You think you know? Uh, I are think they, it might just be a tease, serious? but we'll have to wait and see. Are they seriously having a match this late? Like, there's five minutes left. Like, I understand there's 15 more minutes, but still. There's 20 minutes left because they're allowed to go to the quarter past mark, so that's why. By the look of it, we're not going to get a match because it looks like Edge has just been beaten. Okay, so like, just beat him up for five minutes and announce that he cannot compete. Uh, did any did Brian Pillman Jr. remind anyone of a cross between Brian Pillman and Jeff Jarrett? Now you mention it, yeah, kind of. I get, um, I, I can see that, Ronnie. Uh, hey, go. Andrew. He he looks like a younger nice. version of his dad. But I can see I can see where he gets the Jeff Jarrett comparison from as well. It's the hair. I, I, I can see the Jeff Jarrett in what he's poking at. It's the hair stuff. Fair enough, Harry. I'd personally sell the digital if I were you. Am I watching the Penguins game? Uh, no, I am not watching the Penguins game. I'm only going to be watching the Seattle Kraken versus Vegas Knights uh, game. Uh, but if you wanted to know, uh, there you go. At the end of the second, Penguins are up 2-1. to one. Uh, Oh, and shots on goal are even. So there's an upgrade if you wanted to know, Andrew. Yeah, and it almost cost WWE their TV deal. Me and Tom remember that. I also remember uh, when DX were told, because uh, DX got in trouble with uh, the network, and they were told not to do a bunch of things. So you know when DX ran out that entire list and did the apology of things they shouldn't do? That was an actual yeah. letter that they were sent, and DX just went, well, we're going to go take the piss out of this network letter, and just read every one of them on TV. Thankfully, the network executive that. sounded funny as fuck. I remember that. Uh, that is the most di that is the most DX thing ever. What 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 year was that, Tom? When uh, the whole Stone Cold and Pillman thing happened? Ninety six. Before oh. he before the Austin three sixteen promo, it's what many consider the start of the Attitude Era. Yeah. You won't find that on YouTube, right? Uh, the Pillman segment, probably not. Maybe some uh, normal YouTube accounts uploaded it. You will not see WWE uploading that. Because one, uh, YouTube really doesn't like gun violence. And two, I, I just don't think it's the moment that they want to remember. Yeah, it's definitely on YouTube. Most moments are, but WWE themselves won't upload it because YouTube really doesn't like gun violence. All right, to the point, if you're live streaming and you put a gun on screen, they will terminate your live stream for it. They have very strict rules about showing guns off. Which is kind of sad because... There used to be a load of gun, uh, gun channels that used to show off guns in a really cool way, and then they just kind of just basically mixed them all. You, you can't even do that on TikTok. Yeah. Nice one, man. Uh, I, I 
think this was nice. the link. Nice, nice avatar. Tom? What? This is probably the link. I think this is the link. Put it in chat. Yeah, that's the segment. Yep. But like I said, not uploaded by WWE. Yeah, I just wanted to see it. I didn't expect WWE to have. Apparently, Nitro still beat WWE in the ratings that night. Are you surprised? Yes. I would have tuned into fucking Raw instead of Nitro if that shit were going on. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, it doesn't just... Pillman was taken from us way too soon. He just started his loose cannon gimmick and he passed away. Like, what he could have done with that gimmick would have revolutionized that kind of gimmick the crazy man gimmick i know yeah. he did but he, he could have been something so damn special with that gimmick hopefully his son can carry on the legacy of it maybe slightly less guns though do you think that with Pillman, like they should have given him a different gimmick and not like live under his no, Father's let shot. him carry on his dad's. Honestly, dude, most of the people who are watching, the hot, watching wrestling nowadays don't remember Brian Pillman, Brian Pillman. The bulk majority of the people that tune into wrestling nowadays don't remember Brian Pillman. It's not going to impact yeah. his gimmick. But to the people that do know it will love it for the memory of him. The people that don't know it will start to love Brian Pillman because of his son's gimmick. Did uh, Brian Pillman's wife ever get arrested? I'm seeing a mugshot of her. Or is this somebody else? Melanie Pillman. No, I'm not. I don't want to get it for a minute. Wait, what? Carmelo Hayes wins. Face team. What the fuck is this? What a Jamie post. I'm not watching this shit. Fuck that. Uh, no fall, man. Not four hours. I feel like I'm on an acid trip watching whatever the fuck this is. Why do you think I closed it so quickly? Oh, Undertaker! Lights out? No, I do not want to see any more of this video, JB! American Badass! Tom, shut up. American badass is here. Put some respect on the dead man. I will become the English badass and come kick your Canadian ass if you carry on. <laughs> is he coming out? Come on. Why would he come out to this segment like I... Oh! Hello, Taker. Is he? Why would he, come, why would he come out to this though? Like I understand Braun Breaker, like he's been sitting up like the Undertaker, in, like during his matches, but. Uh, oh no! Nice. Look at that shirt. His first Look assist of his career. He does not set up many people, then, dude. I have a question, Tom. Did they actually announce that Taker was showing up? 
like NXT. No, they just the did the NXT. gong to for the tease. Oh, they never officially announced him, but they teased it. Last ride, tombstone. I was trying to read a shirt. Last ride, tombstone. Keep your mind and business to your fucking self. Choke slam, old school. That's what it says. What is Braun gonna uh, spear him? They're gonna break that man in half. I don't want to see one more match, Jamie, because then the fact they had to film it as a cinematic match just to give him an alright looking match. It took eight hours to film the fucking Boneyard match. Eight hours to make him look half fucking decent in it. They might do that again with him here. I mean, he doesn't really look that old in the face. Well, yeah, but yeah. Taker's like Taker's not physically fit for a wrestling match. No. Please stop letting him yeah. disrespect. We all go on Rick for disrespect his legacy. If Taker comes back for another match, all he's going to do is start shitting on his legacy. All Rick's done, and all he Taker's going to do if he just keeps having matches. He's got a bit of a, a belly too. I agree with four man. Just, I don't want him to shit on his own legacy by having more shit matches. Because, perfectly honest, I anything he's done in the last three years was shit. If they're giving him one more match, it's it's they're gonna have to do it like pre-recorded. They really are. Part by part, so he can take his. Oh, sucker punched. Wow, you're... Joke Sam coming? Uh, well, confirm to you right now, um... Yo, foodie, uh... Their contract wasn't up last week, Jamie, considering the fact FTR is here right now. Yeah, Jamie said they left after that title loss. Yeah, well, they definitely haven't left. They're still here. Mm hmm. Ho oh, train. Sorry, wrong wrestler. Yeah, I was about to say, what? Where do you see the Godfather? I don't. Why would. Do, no, we don't want to take it for another year. He keeps looking at Booker T because they have a lot of history together. Do you think this is going to lead to a match in the future, Tom? No. Breaker will kill him, dude. One spear, and yeah. Dude, no. Breaker is not a, is not is not ready for that kind of match, and two is not soft enough of a wrestler to wrestle somebody who is that old. Breaker will do one spear, and it will knock the fuck out of Taker, injuring him. He's Breaker a powerhouse and a brawler. That is not the type of person that needs to take on Undertaker. Breaker, he no. will Goldberg. He will Goldberg take her. So you don't you want Undertaker to get hurt? I don't want him to get hurt. That's what's gonna happen if he wrestles Breaker. Not saying Breaker's yeah. unsafe, but Taker's fragile and Breaker's not known as being a soft wrestler. Exactly, Borg. I'm really not. Yeah, let's bring Taker back to NXT. That's a great way of having the guy have a decent legacy. Here is one of the biggest legends. Let's just shove him on the sea show. Might as well fucking call him Ric Flair and have him just wrestle a thousand times then. Can re retired wrestlers just fucking stay retired? Uh... 
Uh, Taker is fragile, dude. He's in his 50s. People in their Man, 50s dude. are fragile, no matter how built they are. He takes one wrong landing to break a hip, break a leg, break an ankle. I bet he's not. Like, that's not how bones work, Dougie. Old people have more fragile bones, no matter how built you are. Now all we got to focus on is this edge yes. thing, Tom. Sting, I don't know how the fuck Sting does that. But Taker is not in great health. NXT, done. I'm guaranteeing I could take a spear from Braun Breaker better than Undertaker can. Well, there's no way of solving that bet, is there? <laughs> Dude, T Undertaker wasn't in good health when he retired. Undertaker's been notoriously in bad health over the last couple of years. Which is why his matches have never been great. There's no point, because they're not going to respond, dude. I'm also not going to fly to America. Unless you plan to bet me like 10 grand. Taker is 58. Yeah, and is not in wrestling shape. I don't know how Sting fucking does it. And that, that actually just generally shocked me every time he could do that. Sting is 64. There's no way for me to put up, Dougie. So I'm not going to shut up. They're not going to accept a challenge from a random person in England. There is no way for me to physically put up. Wrestler accepts a uh, match from Taylor. No, you, there's you no are. maybe in this situation. It's never going to happen. Because the lawsuit on that fucker from them to start with. <laughs> Queen's grandson. I'm not the Queen's grandson. Like, come on. Edge wins. Yeah. Would you? I mean, Tom, if they can bring Logan Paul, who did YouTube, they could bring you too. No, because then the fact that Logan Paul's massive star and they got a fuck ton of money for that because of other things as well. Which ending do food is? Yeah, and you're going to drop that right now, Dougie, because I don't want to get rolled up at 3.13 in the morning. Uh, because breaking your neck's not as serious as it sounds. There's hundreds of wrestlers that wrestled after breaking their neck. Dude, Bruno San Martino broke his neck and then got on a plane and went home because he didn't want to go to the doctors to worry his parents. Kurt Angle... Uh, was an Olympic gold medalist with a broken neck. Hey, Joey. Exactly, full man. Yeah, it's hockey. He's just getting beat up by. You ready for another good night of hockey? Uh, you gotta wait till the end of this show, and then you get to leave. That's what I'm uh, waiting for. Game has not started yet, Joey. So the score has still zero zero. Game doesn't start for another 15 minutes. So... Uh, I will generally have to say, apart from Taker showing up, AEW was better. I'm, I'm confused right now. So is the BCC siding with Edge? I don't know. Like, look at what's going on here. It's like, bodies just everywhere. I guess it's just nobody likes uh, Christian Cage, so let's all just beat up a, con a common enemy. You got the Mobile than... Embassy and BCC. Bring me a McDonald's book. Look at Edge. Edge is watching Brian Danielson uh, give him the cripple cross -based. Oh, 
Closing link. Okay, so let's because you've not because we've got two minutes. Let's discuss the shows a little bit before you go off if you want to. I'm only asking for five minutes of your time. Fine. Which one did you think was better overall? AEW. Granted, I will have to give one bonus point to a N uh, NXT for having the bigger moment with Taker showing up. Yeah, I might do it. But to be honest, video. apart from that, the rest of the show was just. I'd say I'd give NXT an average of of six, and I'd give AEW a six point five. Yeah, NXT great. AEW was. You can't vote Ronnie when you didn't watch the other one. <laughs> Uh, uh, very soon. Oh yeah, and Pillman. That was a very good moment. So I'm looking forward to Pillman. Yeah, excited about that. Uh, like, it's yeah, more... it's a shame we got hockey tomorrow, so we'll be live for that. But yeah, there's no wrestling because obviously it was today. Yeah. Overall, that was fun. Uh, nice to relive the uh, the wars. But the main qu yeah, go uh, crack and thanks Fire Beast. It, the main question is who wins. Uh, the actual war on ratings. We'll hopefully find out that by tomorrow. Yep. So, yeah, we're going to hopefully see who wins. But in, anyway, I think AEW is slightly better. Edge won a match. Two belts changed hands. This whole Christian huh? thing is what's getting, like, you know, my attention oh, yeah. with AEW. Christian, oh, everything Christian does right now is gold. Yeah. Had to stack the yep. card too. Oh, they had to stack the card, but in my opinion, it just wasn't as good. Yeah. Like, dude, you just shoot. Like, Asuka's match was, yeah. Cody Road, like, Alley Knight was alright as a special guest, but. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's better than every. any But that's not hard to be better than an average Raw or SmackDown, to be fair. Hey, Fire Beast. But yeah, KK, you may have freedom. Thank you. Hi, Eric Bishop. I will, I will see you Friday. Uh, well, you'll be in the chat, but the next time you'll be in voice chat is Friday for SmackDown. Yeah. Yeah. Friday, Saturday, and then obviously Monday. Yeah, yeah. it's bulk. Peace. Peace. Uh, the weather is... Kind of cold, but dry. It's always good seeing Taker. Yeah, I just don't want to see him wrestle, though. Okay. Nothing going on on Twitch. Okay, Firebeast. Uh, let's move on to Kraken, though. Um, got starting lineups. Oh, thanks, Eric. Uh, where are we? I, I know, I know, Jessica. We'll have to wait until what the ratings are. Nice, Fire Beast. Uh, after the gong tease, I was not surprised. Yeah, that's going to be a really good moment, seeing them raise the banner. Not a big Vegas fan, but it's still going to be nice. It's history. So, yeah, tonight we've got McCann, Benes, Eberle, uh, Schwartz, Weinberg, Borokovsky, Tolmanin, Gord, Bjorkstrand, T uh, Tanev, Pierre, Eduardo, Bellamere, and Yamamoto, with Dunn, Larson, Glasky, Borg, and Dumoulin, and Schultz. With Grubauer and Net with the cord back up. Uh, they are doing it today. Uh, it's in my description. Uh, da, 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 da. Where is it? The, the team will hold a special ceremony prior to the start of Tuesday's contest to raise the Stanley Cup banner in the T Mobile Arena. Players will enter the arena on a special gold carpet where fans 
will be given gold podiums. So yes, uh, there will be a special ceremony. Okay, let's start getting my links together in case people ask. Uh, well. Show links. Yeah, <laughs> Bork, better my playoff hopes are better than yours. Did you even make the playoffs? Or oh, weird. Okay, that's. Yo, 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 how are you doing, Jerry? You missed the entire action. I'm not, I don't want to hurt you. I know you did. That's good. Yeah, it was good. A lot of AW was good. Okay, for some reason, they're not actually showing uh, the hockey at the moment. They're just showing the Pittsburgh game. No, nope, close now. Where are we? You. Oh, nice. Nice. You're not better than me. I'm better than you, and you know it. Wow, 79 grand it ended on at the moment. Jesus Christ. No, you're not. Okay, so we've got... Okay, we're on a good link. Let's just check Doofus Sports. Okay, Doofu Sports. Okay, that's on point with what I'm handing out. Yeah, that's on point. But in case somebody happens to want the home game. Okay. Okay, we've got our links ready. Uh, hopefully, Pablo, yes. Yeah, go Kraken! Uh, obviously, the game doesn't start for a few minutes, so we're just chilling.
Yeah, we're doing all right on this one. One point one. Hey, child. Uh, child. Uh, they have not. No, mate. How do I make my own emotes? Uh, you have to. Uh. If you have channel membership, you can upload them to YouTube and they'll make them emotes as long as you have a membership. Uh, if you see the green name or the badge, like Bork Lazar has, Jay has a green name and a badge, uh, that means they're channel members and can access the custom emojis I upload. It's uh, $1 per month. Uh, or more if you choose so. Uh, yeah, you can make anything in a moat. Yeah. Uh, aren't you just a tier one member? Nice, nice. That's good, Jay. Uh, yeah, you can make emojis outside of YouTube. I don't know if you can upload them to your phone, though. I'm not sure on, on how that would work. I'm not that knowledgeable, I just know I can do it on YouTube. Fine. Massive shout out to Bork Lezer or <coughs> AJ Styles Lover 4682 for physically existing. Uh, unfortunately, I cannot show the event, uh, the actual ceremony, but if you would like to watch the event, uh, you can watch it on there, Char uh, Charlie. Uh, at the moment, with uh, links are not working at the moment. Uh, give me a second. The game will be. Uh, the game will be available on this link. Uh, it's still currently showing the Pittsburgh game, but this we will get the. It will be showing the Seattle game very soon. On that link right there. Damn, Jay. It's a lot of packages. Uh, NHL 24 is already out, Ronnie, so if it's not out for the console now, it's not going to come out. Uh, yeah, it is on PS4, Ronnie. Uh, got released the 3rd of October 2023. Uh, PS5, PS4, Xbox One, Xbox Series S and X. Yeah, it's got released, dude.
Uh, yeah, they are. I don't know why, but they are. Oh, nice, Ronnie. I can't get it due to, uh, you know, the obvious reason of, well, you know, don't have a PS. Well, I'm not buying it on PS4, and they don't have it on PC. Yeah. Well, Chicago just scored. Uh, by the way, do we know if, uh, the Kraken have to wait until this game is finished or we, our game's going to start at the scheduled time. Because right now my only thing is showing me, all my links are showing me the Chicago Penguins game. Is this a case of it's going to be on the same network and we're waiting or what's the deal with this? Uh, give me a second and I'll find out for you. Okay, we're coming up next. Okay, so basically we have to wait for this game to end, is what I'm basically being told. Uh, da 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 da. Uh, C. Gutman. Uh, Cole Gutman scored for Blackhawks. Oh, holy Jesus. Enhance! Holy Jesus. The assist were from Jones and however the hell in life you pronounce that name from uh, from Jones and that dude. Oh, surprise, surprise, Cosby got one of the goals for Penguins.
Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm glad you're good at your job, dude, but yeah, I bet it's tiring. Uh, Borg, if you're curious, this is the uh, Pillman segment. This is the uh, Pillman video. Uh, hey, Mr. Cap, uh, we're waiting for the Chicago game to finish. Uh, I have not Fire Beast. Unfortunately, uh, Mr. Cap, until the Chicago game is finished, uh, I believe the Seattle game does not start. Uh, by the way, uh, I will also like to clarify that games never started directly at the time. But yeah, uh, there's a delay due to the uh, Chicago uh, Chicago Pittsburgh game. So hopefully it will be starting very soon. They've only got six minutes, and hopefully one of them scores so they don't go to overtime. Ah, thank you, Fire Beast. Uh, personally, by a slim, by a little bit of a margin, AEW, in my opinion. Uh, I believe they are, yes. Uh, I do have, uh, hopefully have ways of sending it if they, they, they somehow don't show it. Um, I will let you know, but they should be showing it on ESPN. I don't imagine why they wouldn't be showing that. It's a very important ceremony. He did. He did indeed. Uh, NXT had some good moments. Brian Pillman Jr.'s uh, promo. Uh, Undertaker showed up. Carmelo Hayes Braun Break had a match. Alan Knight was a special guest referee between Dom and Ilya Dragunov. That was alright. Overall, just NXT just didn't hit the same heights as AEW in my opinion.
Come on, one of you score. <laughs> yeah, I know, Jay. Welcome to the desperation that WWE really pulled out for this show. Chicago just scored. Look what we got over here. Oh, hey, thank you for subscribing. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I know. Okay, Firebeast. Uh, let me tell you, yours won't because your subscriptions are private. Uh, your name only appears on the screen if your subscriptions are public. Uh, because by standard, YouTube has them private. You probably you wouldn't have them public. So uh, you will not appear on the screen because of that. But thank you for subscribing. I, I, shout out to Firebeast for subscribing. There you go, mate. You can have a public shout out for it. Let's go. Any team just so we can get the cracking game on the go, please. Okay, who actually doing anything on the scoreboard? Or is it still going to say 10.30? Nope, it's still going to say 10.30. God damn it. I'm about to say. I, I know you did. I appreciate it, man. I do appreciate you subscribing. Uh, we will cover all Kraken hockey, baby. Like, uh, we have a game on Saturday, I believe, which we'll be covering. Uh, we've got a game on Saturday. We've got a game on Thursday. We've got a couple of games this week. I'm looking forward to them. Ah, oh, hopefully you can, Ronnie. <laughs> Probably, Jay. Oh, there's a big scuffle in the uh, Chicago-Pittsburgh game. Broken up by the refs. Yeah, that is true, Jay. That is true. Ah, uh, okay, that's why I've I've got them muted. I just saw the scuffle. I don't I don't actually have the game unmuted, so I couldn't hit I couldn't have heard the whistle. I just saw the scuffle. Uh just gonna do a quick promotion because I can. Uh for anyone who who is new here, um that's the wrong link. This one. Uh, if you at all enjoy gaming content, I have a gaming channel uh, right here. Uh, I do various contents of shorts, uh, pre-recorded and live gameplay. Uh, so if you are interested in any form of gaming, go check out the channel. Consider subscribing because I go live on there at least every Sunday, if not more. Ah, damn. Uh... Hmm. Interesting. Ah, damn. Uh, for Link, uh, no Fire Beast. Uh, I have my own Link. Uh, no, because I'm in the UK, I can't get Fire uh, Sportsnet. I'm actually using an online internet link.
Wait, what? What do you mean my voice gets higher? I agree with Mr. Cap. Oh, hello, Avatar's cat. My cats are asleep. They say hi anyway. Higher pitch when something wicked happens. Oh, I guess it's uh, good to know that I'm reacting well to the game. Oh, I'm sorry to hear you're allergic, mate. Uh, I love my cats. They can be frustrating at times, but they're cute. Yeah, the game will be on soon. Don't worry, Mr. Cap. But hopefully the game will be on soon because, you know, getting later and later and later and I just keep coming to the conclusion that I need to go to bed soon and Jesus Christ, it's getting later and later and later. Uh, also, as a, uh, if anyone's interested in, in an actual gaming video, I've got one pinned at the top of the chat. Uh, it's the latest episode of Infamous. Uh, this one is where I'm doing the good choices in the game. Uh, it's episode four. It's over Reapers. I have the high ground. Yes, it's a Star Wars reference because I can. Uh, unfortunately, I do not, Joey. Uh, probably like five or so minutes, Pablo, I'm hoping. Uh, less than two minutes left in this game, so hopefully they start soon. <laughs> yeah. Bork Lezer, are you here? Because I have things that I should tell you. Okay, thank you, Fire Beast. Uh, Chicago's just secured their win. Like, if you're still here, uh, episode uh, four, uh, episode five of SmackDown vs. Raw is titled Stacy Keebler Lap Dance. Well, sadly, after that, the titles get less amazing. Damn. I don't know. Hopefully we'll get it very soon. But honestly, if you seriously do need to check out my SmackDown vs. Raw games. Uh, yeah, Mr. Cap, as uh, Firebeast said, it's probably uh, 8.14 because of... Uh, who do I predict to score tonight? Uh, I definitely think Matty Benares will score and Jared McCann. Uh, for the Golden Knights... Uh, I'm going to give the goal to... Chandler Stevenson. Uh, they should be. We'll get Knights. Calm down, we'll get them. He could score. Uh, I don't know much about the Vegas team, unfortunately. I am a Kraken fan, so my knowledge on the Vegas team is very slim. Okay. They're not. I uh, I wish that you were right, Ronnie. Uh, maybe I could. Yeah, that's a fair shout. I like both those guys. Uh, let's see if Vegas this league actually has anything up yet.
No, it doesn't. Oh, there you go. Uh, yeah, puck drop is 11.14 uh, to confirm to you, Mr. Cap. 11.14 is confirmed puck drop. Uh, they will obviously be doing the, the ceremony beforehand, but the game will not start. Uh, the actual game will not start for another 20 minutes, but obviously they're going to do the whole ceremony and everything. Uh, but the puck will not drop for like another 25 minutes. Uh, as confirmed by ESPN. Yeah, I've heard of Richie. Go, crack and go. Uh, 3-2 to my team. Yeah, I saw. Same for Nashville. Ooh, good luck. Oh, there we go. We've moved on to stuff about the Kraken now.
Yes, thank you. Thank you, Eric Bischoff. Yeah. Ah, oh, thank you, Eric. Uh, no, I don't know who that was. Who was it, Firebeast? Yeah, it's Kraken. The Canucks. Of course they were. Of course they were. Fair enough. Yeah, we don't talk about the first season. Inaugural season, we don't like to talk about that one. Let's hope, dude. Let's go cracking. Uh, they will be, yes. Thanks for the prediction. Uh, they're just showing off a little video package before they're going to be on the ice. They are. They will be showing the uh, the um, banner ser uh, raising ceremony. They're doing like, a live video package to talk about like things before we're going to get it. We'll be showing it very soon. Good, we kicked your ass. Yes! Thank you for the 99 cents, Eric Bishaw! Uh, it's on ESPN. Um, I don't know if Sportsnet's showing I know ESP. Oh, there you go. That's Mark Stone! Mighty Banners! We love Banners. Thank you, I am Sir English Fucker.
I don't know, Eric. I don't know why he's not a channel member. Uh, it should. It's going to start in the next fifteen minutes, Pablo. Apparently. Yeah, I have no sleep. You get no sleep. We are here to watch the game. Here we go. History. Thank you. I agree with Pablo Stamen. <laughs> no, they're not. Yeah, they are. Uh, no, at least my both of my teams, Eric, made it into the second round of the playoffs. Welcome back, four man. Yeah, you did. We choked in the second, but still. Well, Kraken didn't choke. They just got outplayed. Leafs really did choke in the second. Kind of does. So, you, know, you had a great regular season. I can't deny that. <laughs> yeah, it is. I have got to admit, this is a wicked ceremony. Yeah, I heard. Um, that's a bag. The WWE one's a bag. Uh, very old from a toy shop. Toy shop. Uh, toy shop. Yeah, basically, the, the most of the belts were just kids' ones you could buy for, like, 20 quid. Uh, the WWE one, though, is a, is a bag. And I have the Undisputed version of that on there. Uh, that is Plank! He is wonderful! Plank, yes!
I cannot. I can show you the emoji, but I cannot show you. I cannot get him off the shelf. There is Plank. I can't move him. Because half the shit's attached to it. Like, that's next to it's on there. That title will fall off. Like, like three things will fall off. I'm not moving him. How's what, Jorani? Okay. Send the money. And I'll move him. Uh, the cats are good, thank you, Ronnie. Yes. Nope, sorry. Uh, deal's a deal. Plank, yes. That was hassle. Like he's, f like it's physically attached. Like now I have to move this back on there like that. Thank you. What is my NHL? Uh... Oh yeah. Unfortunately, <coughs> Montreal. <coughs> yeah. Toronto. Uh, and I'd have to think of another one. Uh, I'd say it's a bit um, it's a bit too early to put Seattle on there unfortunately but yeah uh, if we're talking about all time all time unfortunately Montreal is by numbers the best team ever yeah. sorry makes me sick to just talk about that team in a positive note. Yeah, Oilers are, have been a fantastic team for many years. Exactly, like... And why do the Oilers... Ah. Thank you, uh, Eagle. Good luck to the Lightning. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if YouTube would like that name. Uh, yeah, first. <sighs> the 
Yeah, I guess Leafs, Kraken, uh, Montreal, and uh, Oilers. Can't deny how good the stadiums are. Page, Shreya. Yeah, Blackhawks are looking good this season. They really did well tonight. Ah, okay. Jesus, I would not have guessed her. Yeah. Oh, okay, that makes sense, Ronnie. Uh, okay. I was reading the Ronnie comment. Ah. Oh, nice. You'll get that pro hopefully tomorrow. Um, Kraken. Uh, Kraken are oh, my. Th First team going into this season. Uh, Leafs were my first team for the last two years, but I've just uh, oh, we play we play some shitty team from Nashville, I believe. Now nah, it's going to be a good game, dude. But you know what it's time for? Bia! Yes! It was inevitable. I'm not going to lie to you. This literal infinity gauntlet wish.com beer out beer bottle opener I bought for like four quid is by far the best bottle opener I've ever fucking bought. Yes, beer. Yes, it is, David. I did not know that avatar. Good for the apps. Uh, Four fifteen.
Yes, May. I know. Grubauer. You leave Grubauer alone. Grooby. 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 Danny George is a good player. Oh, nice. Uh, the Leafs is uh, minus 3.5 million. Kraken, I think, is something like 10, 20,000, I think. We're not quite here for Kraken. For the Leafs, we are over. Mod. That's it. Uh, Vegas is going to get out of their end. They're going to go on the offense. In the neutral zone, uh, Vegas keeps control of it. A nice pass. Uh, and they got uh, disarmed in the end of the Vegas. I know, that was interesting. I was famous for five seconds. Woo! As famous as I'm ever going to get. I have not played it yet, no. Okay, Avatar. I'll have to check it out. Oh, I'm glad you don't need a link, Joe. I'm glad you could hang out, dude. I appreciate it. I like hanging out with everyone when we're watching hockey. Wide shot there. Okay. Yep. Connor's going in the box for slash in. Yeah, Conman showed up. You missed a lot, dude. Yeah. About about a couple hours ago. Yep. 
Yeah, did I do it? Okay, Dougie. But yeah, Coleman came in. Yeah, he was in the NXT AW stream, dude. You missed a lot. Ooh, Eagle messaged. Yeah, thanks, Eagle. I'll check that out. Maybe it'll make a good playthrough. I don't know why you missed it, dude. Yeah, uh, Con Man came in. His mod came in and gave me $20. Not even joking, you know, I got like twenty dollars from his mod. Like, bro. We're not looking bad. Uh AXD. AXD. Nice. Nice. Is Detective Pikachu any good? Yeah, we've been. This has been a really good power play. We just unfortunately just can't get it in. There you go, that looks that looks a little cleaner. Yeah, I'm gonna have to tear I just have to do that. Yeah, I don't know what you were attempting to do then. Yeah, they do, Andrew. Oh, thank you, Full Man. Ah, no. I'm glad to hear. Uh, your goaltender tonight is... I believe it's Aiden Hill. I can't tell you in a great mood. Uh, no, Pablo. Uh, uh, Shane Wright's gone down to the Firebirds. Yeah, we're... Uh... 
Sprite went back down to the Firebird, so we won't be seeing him for a little while, I don't think. Number 20, there you go. I saw, Andrew, I saw. Surprised that happened, but hey, hockey's one of those games where anything can happen. Come on, guys. Ah, oh, he stumbled. Ah, oh, thank you, Foreman. I really do appreciate that, mate. Go, crack and go. Can we tighten up this defense, please? Jesus, that was another good opportunity they just got. Uh, Philip Grubauer. Gruba Gruby's in that tonight. <sighs> well, we're getting another power play, apparently. Good. Is that a holding call? Yeah, another good chance. We need to stay on them and tighten our defense up. Hey, how you doing, Sleeping Angels? Welcome to the stream. I agree, Andrew. We've definitely got to sharpen up. The power play wasn't actually too bad, uh, the first power play. We didn't get any shots on net, but we looked. We had a good couple of opportunities, but our defense is definitely um, definitely not looking the greatest tonight. So we need to do, definitely need to tighten that up. Yeah, I'm glad you're happy, dude. Uh, no, I don't do any fantasy. Uh, I don't do any uh, betting or anything like that, Andrew. Not my sort of thing. Yeah, true. Let's go, power play boys. Let's do something with this. Hello, Mo, how you doing, man? Surprise, motherfucker. Ten months, dude, that is insane. I appreciate your continued support, Mo. I really do.
Come on, come on, come on. Got a little breakaway by uh, Golden Knights there. Managed to keep it out of our net, thankfully. Oh. Yeah, Eberle's a really good player. Come on. There you go, they're about to full strength. Yeah, Kraken. What a save by Groovy! Uh, did Jonathan get any not shots on goal? Uh, I'm not too sure, mate. I don't know how to check that. Oh, yeah, Vegas gets a cowboy. Oh, that's going to be dangerous for us. Uh, currently drinking this beer, Andrew. Yeah, let's go cracking. Oh, nice, Pablo. I gotta go back to work tomorrow.
Nice save by Groovy. Uh, press to your dad. I'm sorry to hear that, Pablo. On. Ah. Groovy's like the fuck, bruh. Come on, Tanev! Like, brah! I'd expect that play from the freaking Predators. Not from you! Yeah, that does hurt, Joey. No, Tana put it into our net. Tanev's normally a good player, but I don't know what the hell he was trying to do then. <sighs> Tanev, you villain.
Oh yeah, you just you just lose five three instead. Go wings, hey uh Belly, welcome. Yeah, this is uh not going well. Yeah. Oh nice Joe, you haven't got a lot of stuff to die. Lots of stuff going on. Clearly. Oh, nice, Ronnie. Nice bulk as well. I think he did. Where am I putting this again? Oh, it's in my net. Um, oh. Honestly, just spend as much time with them as you can, even when they're boring and doing nothing. Trust me, you'll love it. Even even if you're just holding them, it's it's just an experience. Just try and spend as much time with them as you can. Nashville. I nice say by Groovy.
Yeah, Kirby's having a great game. Defense is leaving him out there to dry. Hi, night, Ronnie. Yeah, that's the end of the first. That was painful. I'm just going to quickly nip to the toilet. Back in a couple while we're on an emission. Oh.
Yeah, very rough ending. God, intermissions are always so long and boring.
Oh, and Kraken needs to do a better second period than the first. I just need to quickly take out something before we get on to the best second half where we score three goals. What's the better one to know? Yes, I own Seattle Kraken shoes because Kraken for life, baby. Let's go, Seattle. I'm back in a couple.
Hi back. Oh my god, what the hell is going on? This is not going well. No, no honk, Dougie. We only honk when my team scores. Yeah, it's going to be a good match, Simon. May the better team win. Of course you do. Oh, Supreme, I don't know why you removed that. Yeah, I still can't, I don't know. I just don't know how we've scored in our own net.
You missed the entire point of why you, like it was what you did afterwards, Dougie, that was the issue, not the 10 second time out. You got mod taken off of you for the giant hissy fit that you threw. Let's hope we do. Let's go, Seattle. Come on, we can do this, guys. Yes, nice to see you here. Okay, good. Yeah, it's more that you flying off the handle afterwards, Dougie, that was the issue. But as I've now stated, 10 second timeouts are not allowed unless needed. And jokey ways are not one of them. Get in there! Yeah, let's hope you can have a better season this year, Simon, because your last two seasons have been abysmal. Yeah. No, Andrew, this is the the Canadians are one of the teams that knocked us out in the first round uh, a couple of years ago like a couple of bad seasons doesn't make a bad team. Like, three, four years ago, they were playing really well, so... That is true, Supreme. Yeah, we scored, dude. It's 3-1. Kraken ain't going down without a fight. Yep, we need at least another two more, and then a, a further one. Ah, uh, Wenberg on the on the penalty for tripping. God damn it! Vegas has a power play. That is not a good thing. Yeah, but KK hasn't given me a problem with massively flying off the handle. The situation isn't about money. Oh, I'm not denying you that he's not cheap. You know, I know he's cheap. No, it does not. Uh, yes, KK definitely supports me, you know, by moderating my chat all the damn time and being in the voice chat. Definitely supports me. Exactly what exactly what KK just said. It's different ways of supporting the channel. 
Ah, sen puta jos mä oon nyt. Ei yeah, me too. I'm not I'm I'm annoyed they didn't. So they've only got five seconds left of this power play. This PK is doing all right. Oh, nice. Yeah, Andrew, let's uh, not touch that one, mate. If they're in Canada, they're Canadian. J just going to point that one out. They're literally a province in Canada, they're Canadian. So, yeah, let's not touch that one. Maybe they do, but at this moment in time, they are Canadian. So, Scotland wants to be their own damn country. Guess what? They're not. So, until then, they're England's bitch. Nobody respects them. Fair enough, Andrew, but in this chat, we respect everybody, regardless of where they're from. So if you have any personal preferences regarding uh, Quebecers, please politely keep that to yourself. You may disrespect their hockey team, but we do not disrespect people who are there from. I don't get into political things, mate. Yeah, we may talk about hockey, but let's not stop disrespecting places. I like to create an atmosphere for everyone is welcome, regardless of where they're from. There you go. They do have some good players. The problem is uh, Canadians can't really do anything with it. At least for the last two years, they've just flopped. You might have a much better season this year, Simon, but the last two years, Montreal's been awful. Yeah, and life's too short to have someone be a dick to you for no reason. So, hey ha. I think he's talking modern players, maybe. Definitely Supreme. No, I'm good. Yeah, but maybe your team should play better, Simon.
Uh, Schultz, I believe. I'll double check for you. I believe it was Schultz. Uh Oh no, McCann got it. I thought Schultz got it. Uh McCann. Uh, because we don't talk about politics in here, Andrew. Yeah. Yeah, we, we don't do political discussions in here because it causes too many arguments. It's just a straight across the board rule because it just causes problems. Come on, Kraken. I have not, Andrew. Oh, let's hope, Simon. <laughs> Damn. Uh, good for him, though. Uh, Ottawa. Hmm. I'm going to go out and let me say yes. Yeah, that's fair for man. That's fair.
Buffalo, hell no. <clears throat> Public service announcement. Dougie, you're not getting mod. Stop. Don't care, you're not getting mod. No, your behavior was bullshit. Okay, trial. Does Dougie get mod? KK, you're the only mod here, vote. Okay, uh, Dougie, uh, Andrew says no, Foreman says no, KK says no. Okay, trial over. Dougie, you're not getting mod. Fair trial. There you go. Pablo says no as well. See, even Andrew knows, and he doesn't even know what you originally did. Oh, that, that, that puts this to bed. Bye then. On Kraken. I value our friendship, but that doesn't equal mod. Go and ask Ben. He's not mod. Friendship doesn't equal mod. It never has. Mods are here to do a job. Dougie, I'm going to put this quite clearly right now. Quit while you're ahead, because if you have another hissy fit in here, you're banned. Simple as that. After what you did last time, you're on thin ice. So pipe it, shut up and leave, or get banned. Uh, we play on Thursday. Dougie is from uh, America. Mom, we need to get another goal. Yes, he said my name. Yeah, 
but your behaviour isn't giving me much of a choice if you have another hissy fit. We're friends, but that doesn't mean you can come in here and personally attack everybody in the chat. Because unfortunately, dude... I need to make sure the chat is nice and calm for everybody. Because I've put too much damn work into this channel to have it look like shit. Yeah, just because you do that, which I appreciate, does not mean you can come in here and throw hissy fits. You've got to be nice, polite, and respectful to everybody in the chat. And follow the rules. That's everybody has to do. Do I make a decent amount off this channel? Absolutely not, Andrew. Definitely not. This channel doesn't even pay for itself with the amount that I have to put into content. When I do shorts and everything... Uh, McCann's playing today, yes, Angel. Uh, we've just gone to second intermission. Uh, I'm a chef, Andrew. Hello. Goodbye. Uh, McCann getting more than four shots. I would go with yes. Uh, most of the food we do at my job is alright. There's a couple of bits I don't like. Uh, hello, Bella. Uh, definitely don't know how it's going to go. Uh, they definitely tightened up their defense, uh, but there was a good lot of offense in this period as well. So I'd say Vegas is going to be quite defensive. Kraken's going to go quite offensive. Uh, no, Andrew, I've never been to Canada. Oh, what? What's wrong with Toronto? My co-host, who's normally here, uh, KK, is from Toronto. Uh, favorite food varies. Okay. It's a hellhole. Fair enough. Duly noted. Don't go to Toronto. Um, what's my favourite? Honestly, uh, it always varies, dude. Like right now, if you ask me if what I'd want to eat in the entire world, I couldn't even tell you because I don't fancy anything. I just, what I fancy and what I like just change on a daily or even weekly basis.
Okay. Well, I live in quite a small town, Andrew, so I, 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 England it's quite nice as well for smaller towns. Uh, yeah, that's fine, Fall Man. You go rest up, dude. Fair enough. Yeah, I might avoid Toronto then. I've heard there's a place called Hamilton. I've heard things about that. I'm joking, Hamilton sucks. Uh, it'd be nice, but I don't see it, Pablo. Yeah, I know Hamilton sucks. I have a friend there. Ah. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. For man, you take some time to uh to just chill after that. Mm, I think people who are in Toronto could probably verify if Toronto shit or not. Yeah, you wouldn't get that in England. Ah, oh, no problem, Gateway. How you doing, man? Uh, it's not going well for us tonight, If uh, depending on who you're sporting. I'm sporting the Seattle Kraken, so it's not a great game for us tonight. Not all of them. Yeah, no, that's not how people work, Dougie. Are people in England snobby? Depends where you go, Andrew. Really does depend where you go. Where I'm from, no. Uh, the further you go down south, the more snobby they kind of get. Nice. Uh, yeah, but I know how the human race works, and 90% of an entire country is not nice people. I do not, Andrew, no. I don't have time to cover it. Yeah, and I spoke to people who lived in Canada their entire life, and they'll verify that, that no, you didn't meet all the Canadians. Uh, 
There is a lot of Canadians. I spoke to... Yeah, that's not... That's not a... That's not the very... Mass, that isn't, like, less than 1% of their population. I spoke to a lot of Canadians who will verify a lot of them are assholes. No, I just like to t t tell people when they're making a stupid point that doesn't make sense. Thank you for that update, RJ. Uh, Dougie, you do realise that Canada is a part of of part of England, right? At one point, it's still part of like the Queen's like entire kingdom. You do know this, right? That's why the Queen is on their fucking currency! It's class as a province of fucking England! Ah, fair enough, Matthew. I got tired of typing. Fair enough. That's fair, Matthew. That's fair. Yeah, the Queen is on the Canadian. Queen is on their currency because, like, it's still considered a part of the British Empire. You do know, yeah, Canada is a part of the British Commonwealth. So you've been to every single province in Canada. Every single one of them. <laughs> Let's list off every place. Tom, what are you googling? <laughs> How many provinces are in Canada? <laughs> I know, oh man. Ten provinces. Why would you give the answer out? Uh, Dougie, uh, I'm pretty sure Canada from play from one end to the other is more than three thousand miles long. Been to everyone or everywhere. Canada is one of the largest countries in the world. So. I'd also like to mention that it doesn't happen every day in Toronto where it's unsafe. Also, I'd like to mention... Um... That you Just met a thousand Canadians. There is fifteen million Canadians in Toronto alone. Yeah, just because you've been there a few times and nothing happened, doesn't mean it's a safe spot. You so yeah, I'm not believing that you've been to every single one of the provinces in Canada and oh, spent more than enough time to actually talk to all of them either. I wasn't buying it from the beginning. Nah, you're full of shit, Dougie. Yep.
I was literally about to t type that, Andrew. British Columbia is a province. Um, what is the uh, what is the capital of British Columbia? Let's see if you know this. I have no idea off the top of my head. Vict Victoria. Ah, nice. Uh, you mean Calgary with a C? Galgary. What? I want to go to Galgary. <laughs> Calgary is pretty nice. It has nice houses. <sighs> yeah, that's oh, also dude. not a territory either, dude. <laughs> Um, he looks so done. I mean, if you have two duffel bags, you definitely don't need clothes. Thank you, Hunter. Also would like to mention the uh, current estimated population of Canada is just under 40 million. A thousand is not 90% of that. No. Guaranteeing a lot of those 40 million people are probably douches. Maybe. I wanted them to my voice chat right now. I will hurt you. <laughs> I know you will. <laughs> Yeah, I literally just said that to Tom. When is your little game thing ending? In like, what, two more hours, Tom? Uh, about 45 minutes. Well, it's not that bad then. <laughs> It's six o'clock in the morning, KK. Uh, yeah, for you at that. Yes, I'm working today, Pablo. I don't get that. I'm working in f in five hours. Uh, no, no, it doesn't. I, don't. I own this stream. 
He doesn't own this place at all. Never claimed to. No, he really doesn't. The idea to unmod you was my idea. Nobody even brought it up before I unmodded you. No, he doesn't. He does the job I ask him to do, which is tell the chat on how to behave, which is exactly what his job is. Once upon a time, if I told KK, if I told KK right now to stop telling people what to do, he would just stop doing it. Yeah, I would let Tom have. He moderates the chat on how I like him to moderate the chat. Unlike some people who misuse their power. Thank you for the suggestion, Andrew. If I do go to Canada. I do. They're in the description. They're in the well, description. They're, they're not actually, but they're, they're yeah, basic yeah, rules. You should know what they are. Yeah. I don't have room in the description, to be honest, but they're, they're all basic rules anyway. I still, I still have them copied and pasted. So. I know. I have them as well. Thank you, Fall Man. He's talking facts. I like hearing four man's opinions. They're good. He doesn't lie. No, he doesn't lie. Andrew, be nice. Don't worry. Won't go on much longer, poor man. <sighs> I've done my work close. I made sure to put my bin out because it's fucking bin day. Yeah, that was a good save. I got my protein shakes and I got my meal prep done, so I'm good for tomorrow. Sound. There you go. Hello, mate. Oh. Welcome to the stream. Okay. My wish was for a bacon sandwich and a hot Asian woman. <laughs> Is that coming? <laughs> Apparently, we have our wish. Is a hot Asian woman going to knock on my door with a sandwich? Probably Godric. Probably did. I sent you a, a meme uh, via DM. Might make you laugh even more. Uh, yeah, I know. That, that is that is so funny and relatable. I agree with that. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I'm telling you, bro. Is it all a joke? 
Uh, considering the fact these streams are designed to be for me to forget my being sad and upset. Yeah. The whole point of this shit is so people can come here and forget a... random shit like that. Point no, is I'm laughing a... about. I'm, I'm not laughing at you. I think it gave me. Yeah, I sent him a meme. Full point no, of these streams. Is meme? Have a good time. I don't want you to be crying, yeah, yeah. Logie, but there's not really much I can do. I'm in England. The same can go for the people that get attacked for no reason. Someone just got insulted. Yeah, unfortunately, about you, you're in the crowd of people that are mostly depressed who come here to forget their depression, like me, like poor man. So, unfortunately, we don't tend to have a lot. And suicide is not something to play with. It really isn't. As someone who's attempted it. And has family members who have also attempted it. Same. That's why you don't joke around with that. I say, at least losing in the playoffs is hilarious. No one at this point has laughed at you, Dougie. Literally. Talk about suicide and this whole thing goes south. Oh no, Tanov is down. I don't know. I really don't know, Andrew. See, and you talk about being sad when you're talking about people's moms. Probably, Andrew. I actually generally don't know. Doesn't mean you bring up people's families. When has Andrew been a dick? Andrew's done nothing to be a dick. Uh, let's see the... It was the comment, Tom. You won't be able to see the Leafs game if you commit suicide. That was after Please Don't Kill Yourself, fellows. Hmm, yeah. I still don't agree the fact that you're bringing up family members. That sounds like a compliment. I'm <laughs> sure you do, doggy. Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna I wouldn't back down. Oh, Tanov got checked for the head. 
Actually, I don't bother you. I mind my own business. You get drunk, and then you start picking on people. Speak facts. Thank you, Tom. And you want to talk about being sad. Look at you making insults. <laughs> God damn it, Andrew. See, this is what the hockey shoes are more interesting than wrestling. Because of your chat. Hey, the hockey's been a good game. Well, people like you, just not this version of you. When you attack people. For no reason. I about to say, you did say Dick Dougie was dead, like, earlier. That didn't last long. Oh, I'm sorry, Andrew. I got a five minute power play because of a check to the head. I'm hoping Tanev's okay. I don't know how we didn't just score there, and that was a good couple of opportunities. So how's your evening going, KK? Because you had been very quiet for a while, and then you just you were alive. Yeah, no, oh, I was listening. I, I I have your audio in the back. Once my name I was brought you were up, asleep. Once my name was brought up, you know I had to give my two cents. Yeah. Like, why is my name being brought up when I'm not even here? No, we're not gonna let this continue like this for much longer format. <clears throat> The suicide thing, that's not something to fucking play with. No. God, they do have a good scheme. Although, I'm not going to lie, I do make those jokes, but I make it in a room at work, when I'm at work. Which is different, because I won't make those jokes here. Well, you know, just chill out and be normal and nice and kind exactly 10 hours a night hell no for a dude he games Most I get is probably hours. 8 if that he, go he games for 10 hours <laughs> yeah he's not going to put up with this behaviour from you either Yeah, You're the one attacking me. people! This is you threatened to kill yourself about four different times in this conversation in the last 20 minutes! I don't feel safe here. Continues to insult everybody. Come on, dude. We need to get it in. Jesus. That's what she said. I think the most I've ever slept is like 14, 15 hours. 
15 is wild. Although nowadays, if I go better, say, 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the morning, the most I get up, it, latest I get up is at like 2. Average human needs like at least 9 hours of sleep. I do not get that. Huh? Hi, Dougie. <sighs> Jesus, Pablo. Oh no, most average people do get about eight to nine hours of sleep. They're, they're, they're people that don't have to work in a kitchen till 10 o'clock at night, do a live stream, and then you have to go back to work at 10 o'clock in the morning. Most people are normal. Come on, guys. We need to take advantage of this. Fair enough. Um, I sent you a picture that you might want to use for a stream. Ooh. It's brought up. Huh? If it's brought up again. Because you did say, right? Hmm? Final. Yeah, we've not had a good power play with this. Because we've all got our own shit pe things to deal with, Dougie. You're a random person on the internet that we can't help. If you have problems, ring the suicide helpline. To most people in this chat, yes, you are. Yeah, I wasn't talking about me. Most people in this chat who you are telling, why does any why doesn't anyone care? Most people don't know who you are. All they can do is say, get some help, mate. What am I meant to do? I do care. But when you're blasting this shit in my chat, it's hard to just acknowledge that. You're in my chat, uh, uh, disrupting my live stream on a thing I've worked seven years to build, dude. I know, Godric. I don't, don't know how he didn't score. All I'm trying to do at six o'clock in the morning is watch a hockey game. How much time did you say is left on? Uh, I've got eight minutes and fifty seconds, so that equals about twenty minutes, including twenty twenty five minutes, including commercial break.
I know they're gonna lose. I'm gonna be here till the end though, Pablo. I have my DMs open. I have a bunch of stuff to send you for uh, the next stream. Okay, sound. Yeah, I I'm going to agree with Andrew here. I can't help you with your problems. Okay, I'm done. About time. You on your last warning, Dougie. You're done. I told you if you threw another hissy fit, you'd get banned. Don't even attempt to ask to be unbanned because you get you got one chance left and I told you to quit while you're ahead. The auto accounts Tom? Uh well they have to come in for me to get them. It's okay, it's fine for man. I know I'm your lord. The lord of YouTube. I, Tom, I will slap you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the lord of YouTube. And then what do you call it? If you're the lord, then what is con man? I don't yeah, know. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I don't know what con man is. He's the savior. He's not going to save us from WWE wrestling. No. Vegas really does score easily, dude. You're going to make that promise to me, though, Tom. Going to keep your word. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, yes, Andrew, I am streaming the Leafs game tomorrow. I ain't dealing with that again. Wait, I can't hear you for some reason. Hello? Hello? Yo. I don't know what you did to your thing. Oh, I'm glad you enjoy it, Pablo. Yeah, I try to be a good friend to everybody. I'm glad you're here, and I'm glad you're watching the stream. Yeah, I can hear you now. Sound. Yeah, but... You are going to keep your word with me, right? Oh, definitely. Good. Like, no, uh, yes, no. it is for man. If and when it comes in, it will get banned. Now you can watch the hockey. But so I can sit here and watch uh, Seattle lose. At least you're watching the hockey without getting distracted. Exactly. Oh, it's over now, Pablo. I, I, I warned. The... I gave an opportunity to stop it, and they didn't take the opportunity. Like, look how positive your chat is now. Yeah. This is the type of uh, energy. Exactly. We don't need. Uh, Gro yeah, Groovy's been really good. Just a shame that they got a good couple of opportunities before. <laughs> no, Jamie just messaged me. <laughs> what did Jamie message you? 
<laughs> she's like, he's like, I rolled over. What happened? <laughs> I rolled. <laughs> Ah, thanks for the one dollar forty nine. Ah, Vegas just scored, didn't they? No, still that one in. That message from Jamie was just too funny. <laughs> well, just right over said, "What the fuck is going on?" <laughs> I rolled over and I just saw what happened. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, it's fine, Pablo. Thank you for letting us know, for man. But it was dealt with. Oh my god. No, no, it's, it's fine, Pablo, it's fine. No, he's all good. He was just getting our attention. Five minutes left and we're down by two. And this is not looking good. What, there's five minutes left of this game? Yeah. So about ten or so minutes. Ten, fifteen minutes, depending, with commercials. So fifteen to the most. Yeah, pretty much. Yo, I need a protein bar. Hungry. Dude, it's half one. You can't be eating now. Listen, 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 Tom. You don't judge a man. You don't judge a I'm man. I'm judging you. <laughs> you don't judge a grown ass man. I paid my bill. You're a I grown ass man? Want. I do what I want. Fucking Tom sounding like my girl right now. Oh, you shouldn't eat right now. It's bad to eat later. Now. Listen, woman, my body, <laughs> my body, my choice. My uh, stream is lagging. Right. That's definitely on your end, Godric. My stream's uh, working fine for me. Uh, do I own a house? Uh, I own, yes, Andrew. Yeah, it's not lagging for me. Uh, my 15 other screens aren't lagging. No. I'm kidding, I don't have 15 screens. You have like about three. Pretty much. Obviously, you have three uh, screens and you have like three phones in front of you. Pretty much, just to check and test things if I require it. Real estate in Canada is ridiculous. Real estate makes you a lot of money. Yeah, if you've got real estate... It's good, but if you don't have it, it's ridiculous to get. England's not... Actually, to be fair, England's quite bad at the moment. Uh, a three-bed... Uh, a two-bedroom house is going for the price of what a three-bedroom house went for a couple of years ago. My my oldest brother, he does real estate. The one that I told you, Tom, that owns the Lamborghini. Yeah, you also do real estate. I want... I don't do real estate. I want to get into it. You rent like, out your parents' old house. Huh? But you rented out your parents' old house. No, my old house, like, like uh, I gave it to uh, college students. Remember I told you? We bought them, my parents, a new house. But my old house, it's rented out by students. You were warned several times.
Uh, Tom's 40. I'm 20. I'm 30. KK's 40. Uh, Thirty-six. Uh, Andrew, I'm going to say you're twenty-four. Nice. Okay. Yeah, it does look like we might end 3 1. Uh, currently sitting at 580 views, Jamie, so much better than anything else it's done this week, so. You know what? The views are the views are good. I've got a good chat going on, regardless of something that happened. Oh, the score? No, definitely not. But it was exactly what I was expecting. Uh, I am sorry to hear that you had to deal with that four man. You're always welcome here for exactly who you are. Uh, could do, but I don't believe we pulled our goaltender. We haven't. So they're not going to get an empty nether. We've only got 13... Oh, no. Yeah, we've uh, we've got 1 minute and 54 seconds left, and we haven't pulled the goaltender yet. I try to be a four man. Okay, we've pulled the goal. We've pulled the goaltender. I wonder if we got an update. Who's the sexiest NHL player? Uh, honestly, dude, I can't say I've looked. Piper Shaw, who works for uh, ESPN, is pretty sexy. He's a really fair announcer to do with hockey. I'm going to be in the comments. There's your empty nether. Okay. Hello? Hi? Hi? Why? I, was gonna, I said I'm going to be in the comments. Sound, so. No, we just work sometimes, just not a lot of the time.
All right, bye, Andrew. No, we don't suck. We just got outplayed, dude. It's Vegas. They're a really good team. If anyone wants to know a fun fact, uh, Kayla Yamamoto making his debut is the first Washington-born player to play for the Kraken. He's our first home-born player. Also, another fun fact, McCann has scored in all three of the season openers for the Kraken so far. Every single season opener, Jared McCann has scored in. Yeah, that was a good, a good game. Unfortunately, it did not go our way, which is a shame. Uh, yes, I'm going to bed. It's currently uh, 20 to 7 in the morning for me, Joey, so 6.40 a.m. Yeah, I'll definitely be trying to go get some sleep before I have to be at work in like 4 hours and 20 minutes. So, probably going to get about 4 hours of sleep. Yeah, exactly, Pablo. Damn, Jerry, nice and early for you, very late for me. Anyway, guys, uh, yeah, I'm at work at 11 a.m. Yeah, see you tomorrow. So, yeah, we'll be back tomorrow with uh, Leafs hockey, Leafs versus the Montreal Canadiens, uh, game one of the for the Leafs. Yeah, joyous viewing to you all, and until tomorrow, check out my gaming video. Seriously, go check this out. Watch it, enjoy it. Until tomorrow, guys. Joyous viewing.